everybody. Hello. Coming to you from a different setting, we are home. Mm-hmm. Can't you tell? We got the jumpers on. <laughs> So we've realised that we haven't done an introductory video to our time in Kalgoorlie. So this is it. This is it from Mildura. That's right. (laughs) So when we arrived in Kalgoorlie, we had no idea how long we were going to stay there for. The first place that we visited was the Tourist Information Centre. And we quickly realised there was heaps to do in Kalgoorlie. So we organised the tours and things that we wanted to do and then we booked in for four nights at the caravan park. Yeah, we booked in on some tours and um, they were really good, really worth doing because you get so much more knowledge. You get told um, where if you go around and do it yourself, you sort of miss a few things where with the tour operators, they know all the little secrets. So it's really good. The um, super pit was amazing. The, um, The tram bus tour around the town was really good and yeah it was took us yeah. to some interesting places really good. and it was good because it gave you an idea of the places that you wanted to go back and see so they took you past different places and told you a bit about them and then you could go back and visit them um, yourself yeah. later so the tours that we booked um, was the tram tour that Craig mentioned the super pit tour and we also did a brothel tour which was really good, really interesting. Yeah, <laughs> so not not something that you would normally think of doing on a holiday, but we were in Kalgoorlie. It was a brothel that had been established for over 100 years. It was still a working brothel. It was a really fun tour because we actually met up with a couple that we had stayed with in Geraldton at the free camp there, and we ended up doing the tram tour with them and also the brothel tour. And going on the tour with somebody that you had a friendship with made it more interesting, particularly in the brothel tour, um, because Mario and Craig had a few interesting little bits of information that they shared or (laughs) asked questions about. So it was really, really fun. So even though a brothel tour may not be something that everyone wants to do, just for the sheer sticky beak, curiosity, um, just just go do it. So we have put some photos of inside the brothel up. We understand it's not for everybody. So there is a part in the video where I allude to the fact that the photos are coming up. So if you don't want to see them, just Look away turn now. it off. <laughs> yeah, don't watch it. But there's nothing there. There's yeah, nothing no. that, you know, is too bad. Um, but Kalgoorlie was really good because obviously it's got a really strong gold mining history and gold mining is the predominant um, activity there as well as tourism. But just lots to do. The two up shed was fun, wasn't it? Yeah, really good. Really interesting. Yeah, it was a really it was a really good few days. So mm. we really enjoyed our time there. Uh, definitely put it on your places of um, interest. Or yeah, your definitely list on or... your list of places to see um, because there was a lot to do there. It was really mm. really good. We hope you enjoy the video, and we will see you in the next, next one, one which, which will be one of the last. I was going to say, might be the last one. All, All right, right, bye everyone. See ya. Bye.